Hello my beautiful moon bays and fellow gems. If you're watching this video, then you probably know that this is going to be the second month's reading for earth signs. If you are Virgo, Capricorn, or Taurus, this reading is for you. Leading up to the next month following this video, that's what I'm manifesting, I am bringing guidance to earth, air, fire, and water signs every month here on my channel Divinely Danica, which will also be diffused across moonwood.co. So if you are an entrepreneur looking to join a group of mind, body, and spirit conscious individuals do check out moonwood.co on instagram and facebook as well as moonwood.co and there is a ton of information as well as a really supportive community of young entrepreneurs looking to align their lives on all levels and in all aspects to reach where they're supposed to be in due time so earth signs Last month, I asked you to get grounded in nature, to go outside. If you did not see last month's guidance, it might still be helpful to you. However, I do encourage you to take in all the messages that are about to come out in this video. I am a Virgo moon, as well as Venus, and another sign that I cannot recall right now. If you want to know what are, <coughs> sorry, Ooh, that means some of you are really going to want to go look into what are all the signs in your zodiac chart. If some of you want to know what are all the signs in your zodiac chart, then you might want to go online, type in zodiac chart calculator, enter your date of birth, your time, location, and you'll find out. Virgos are getting a lot of information this month and even though this is an earth sign reading, the messages coming through, especially pertinent to those who have Virgo sun, moon, rising or Venus. is very weird but I'm being told to say it also if you find out that you have your Mars in Scorpio very important for Virgo so Virgo oh my gosh if I'm not mistaken you got the exact same card last month king of bows adder so we interpreted this card last month it was about seeing trouble and wondering if all those people who are contributing to that trouble are doing that because it could be worthy of your time. The answer was no. The answer is still no. That we've got the king of bows reversed, which to me indicates that Virgo is still having a very hard time trusting their intuition when it comes to knowing where to get mixed up when it comes to situations or not. So I think this is what you guys have been kind of getting into in the past. You guys have been getting completely messed up in situations that you should not have been participating in. Look at this woman being stabbed with arrows. The seven of arrows, insecurity. It's like the seven of wands. Needing to defend yourself. But I'm seeing that my Virgos overall have understood that they do need to step into a position of assuming self-protection and defense. So that was a very pointed message for Virgo. I'm going to request, but it's not going to be from this deck, a card for Earth signs, okay? So maybe a lot of Virgos will watch this. A card for earth signs. We will be picking from the Isis Oracle deck. Earth signs overall. That was a message for Virgo. Stop getting mixed up in garbage and drama. So, earth signs. Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo. 
I want a message related to what you need to do with your energy for business. What do you need to do with your energy for business? In terms of accomplishing your highest business goals and ideas. Ideas. Ideals. Okay, new ideas. Okay, Temple of Lazuli. So already a stone recommendation, Lapis Lazuli. This is the back of the card. Let me read it. Your soul is very ancient and holds the wisdom of star peoples from civilizations with unique high vibrational awareness that can help humanity transition from a culture based in fear to a love based community. You are here on this planet to be you to the fullest extent possible. Then you will help heal human culture so that the planet may thrive. So Virgo. Your business goal this month is helping the planet thrive. Helping the planet to thrive. Okay. I'm going to ask about any... Ooh, all the cards fell. All my decks fell. Interesting. Beautiful. Thank you. I'm going to ask about any blockages that the earth signs may have. Sorry if I still speak a lot. I'm sp in my spirit. I feel like I'm speaking a lot to Virgos this month. Sun, moon, rising, or Venus. To know those things, you have to Google it and enter your information. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay. So Virgo definitely... Oh my God. Why is this turning into a Virgo reading? The Virgos in this group definitely got involved in situations that broke their hearts. They may have felt like the wheels were against them, but now they're going to find their fortune. So any of you... Uh, Virgo in your chart and a placement that you think is prominent as well. Listen to these messages from Virgo. I do feel that Virgo and this group kind of like the earth sign that is leading by example. And maybe because we passed the other earth signs. So we've passed Capricorn season. We've passed Taurus season. And Virgo is coming ahead. So it's going to be really important for Virgo to get guidance. I... I I don't understand why Virgo's popping off so hard. It could also be because the earth is healing at the moment with people having stayed home. Mother Gaia, earth energy, very strongly linked to Virgo, could be healing and wanting to speak to the sign coming up. Okay, so we've got music and harmony as an overall message for earth signs. But again, especially hitting hard for those who have Virgo in their chart. I will say for the last time, sun, moon, rising, or Venus placements. Music. Harmony. So Temple of Lapis Lazuli. Harmony. Things were against you, but you've understood what your broken heart was about. Things felt like they were against you, the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, but you've got... The whole world in your hands. You got the whole world in your hands. Very interesting earth signs with that message of having the world in your hands. If you guys play an instrument. Or for those who have earth placements in very prominent places in the chart. Probably start picking up instruments that you've had. Or especially play music right now, even if it's one song on the piano, like me. Because that harmony that you can hold and create in your hands transfers to those around you and brings a sense of calm to everybody around you. Bit of a strange reading. I understand where we're going with that. 
the woman in this card is holding a baton in her hand she's naked her hair is green and she's surrounded by green leaves again very earth energy very virgo energy i have to say very 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 virgo the fact that it's two earth women here in this card playing wooden instruments is also very virgo energy so i cannot say it enough this month earth signs as a whole please get in tune with creating harmony around you and for many of us it's going to be through music and i say us because again my virgo uh placements are in venus and in my moon last do we need an angel message no we do not even need an angel message guys you guys literally are the angels this month okay earth signs Virgos, you are the angels this month. For Virgos, I saw Virgo placements and what I mentioned. I saw you've been through a lot, but you've learned how to love even harder as a result. And for the rest of the earth signs, start tapping into music as a way to shift vibration, increase your vibration, and even get answers regarding what it is that you should be doing for business and for overall energetic alignment same advice as last month continue to be out in nature but now i'm seeing make noise in nature make music in nature sing with nature dance with nature commune with nature be naked with nature and she's holding a little golden what looks like a pouch to me in her hand that is how you're going to get your bag this summer earth signs capricorn taurus virgo make sure you spend an adequate amount of time in nature your sanctuary and work with blue stones everything's very blue today down to my lips and my eyes work with blue stones lapis lazuli being a great stone for all earth signs in the coming month so this reading is extremely pertinent for the month to come but all my advice is overall timeless whatever you manifest is what you'll get out of what i put out thank you so much for watching i hope that this video will be of help to you do like and comment down below if it is do not forget to subscribe if you'd like to stay up to date with what it is that i'm doing hit that little notification bell if you want to be told and if you are a youtube user if you want to be told of when new content is coming out and if you are a um viewer coming to me through the moonwood.co platform thank you so 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 much for your energy thank you for your attention and i hope that you move ahead deciding to be this fiery beast in the midst of nature transmuting and transforming everything around you dear earth sign because you definitely have the power do not forget that you can book me for personal readings through dm or by email all information is linked down below i look forward to hearing from you take care in love and light i leave you for now Bye bye